Medical terminology is not hard. I'm breaking down a full breakdown right now in this video. Let's go. Medical terminology is broken down into four main parts we gotta know first. So prefixes. Prefixes is the beginning of the word. That is the location or the intensity. It's the beginning of the word. Suffixes is at the end of the word. Now, that deals with condition or the status of the patient and the diagnosis, all right? Root words. So root words deal with your location or the structure, right? Now, this is where you're gonna find the Latin and Greek words under root words. Now, down here, I wanna show you an example of what they mean by combining vowels. The whole goal of this combining vowels is to make medical words easier to pronounce. So I have an example here for you. Now, let's break down this word. If I look at the word like this, it's pretty intimidating, right? If I use the combining vowel strategy, you know what vowels are, look at the O's here. So here's how we're gonna break it down. So it's stern, O, Clyde, O, mastoid. And there it is, right? So we break it down like that. That's how you do it. Now, super important here, not every word is going to have a prefix and a suffix. So, but there will always be a root word with one of the two, right? So we can have a root word, prefix, we can have a root word, a suffix, depending on what we're talking about. I'm gonna show you examples of all this right now. Here are some of the most common prefixes that you'll see. So a or an, without or lack of, like apnea or anemia. Apnea means without breath. Anemia means lack of blood. Moving from there, angio talks about vessels, like an angiogram, which is the study of vessels. Okay. Now here's brady, means slow. So bradycardia is a slow heart rate, right? Anytime we see card anything, think of the heart, okay? Anti, against or opposed to. So an antipyretic literally means against fever, right? Take that if you have a fever, right? Anti, okay, so anti, before or forward. So antenatal, what does that mean? That means formed before birth. And there it is. Here's our suffixes. Now, algia is pertaining to pain, like neuralgia. Now, with neuralgia, it's pain along a nerve. Moving on to synthesis, that's puncturing. Like we're puncturing into the pericardium, that is pericardiosynthesis. There that is. Genic. Genic means causing. Cancer causing is carcinogenic. There it is. Osis. Osis means a condition of. So condition, well, here it is. Psychosis, a condition of the mind. Pathy, disease, like neuropathy. Now with neuropathy, what that means? Disease of the peripheral nerves. And there it is. I've compiled a list to give you a head start with the root words. Let's get into it. Root words, myo is muscle, nephro, kidney, neuro, nerve, pneumo, air, cardio, heart, glyco, sugar, hepato, liver. Now, with these three, people get tripped up, so let's break it down. Arter, artery. Arthro, joint. Be careful with that one. Cephalo, head, cyto, cell, gastro, stomach, and hemo, blood. Now I'm going to show you on the screen right here an example with all of these. First link in the description is lifetime access to my video vault that includes EMT, advanced EMT, paramedic school prep, medications, anatomy and physiology and National Registry Prep at every level with lifetime access to over 420 videos of content. 
You get access to our group as well by clicking the first link in the description, and I will see you in the next video.